Bali. Yes, today we are going to learn some, have some uh, more words, 43 words. So let's start. Bash, good. Be, made be. A form of verb bu, be, become. So be, made be. Made be, be. If we give, we should give example, what example we should give. Um, how, what can we say? Derbasibe. Derbasibe. Derbasibe, which means uh, get well soon and you may pass it some, some meaning. Derbasibe, simply use like this. Bağven, bağven, talk, speak. Also, qısa, qısa kirin. It is also talking. Okay, qısa kirin. It is also talking. Qısa kirin, bağven. Talk, speech. Bəmine, may it rem remain. A form of the verb may stay, remain. Bəmine, mayin, bəmine. It is actually, we can say, mine, mine, even like mine, we can search over the, over our, the best um, browser, which is this one, which is, uh, from here I am going to wiki, wiki Ferhang, and from wiki Ferhang I went to simply search, b, b, mi, ne, b, mi, ne, so one, mine, ma, so here you see I don't have the table. I showed the table before and I am going to show the table. Here you are, where is the table? Still we don't have the table. So bla main stay, but yes. Main 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 and man min then juda naven man. So you see, bemine, main, bemine, bemine. You see, min, main, man, man. As not, not like I said, main, but man, man. Okay, but when I search for main, did we get any, any, any thing? When I say main, nuchen, nachunyan, naguharin, nuchen. This is also right. But this actually comes from ma, mahin also. Here we have another one, mahin. And mahin. So, yakjamar mahin, mahina, chimendi mahine, mahinek. So, this is actually mahinek. So, man, man, that's it, man, man. Man is our uh, stem. Man is our word and mean for the present tense it is mean, for the past tense it is ma. We just mentioned about this. Main, ma, man, man actually, man. Man, so may it remain, stay remain, so it means it is actually in future tense, right? That's true because you have to put b in here and man is simply uh, stay and b mean a. May it remain. It means like it will stay in there. We can't think like that. It it, it, it will stay. It means it, it remains. True? Yes. Brasti, really. Brasti, really. Brasti, really. Also, rusty is, means uh, really. Bakher, good. Bakher is more. More. Actually, does khair doesn't mean good, for example. Khair means, actually, khair means good. Yeah, that's true. But it is more generally this is uh more in more religious way you know but at least we are using as opposite of sin what is the uh, good behavior here so it can be good as well here it is good by the way we use this word for some other things too for example somebody tell you a news you you can say which means which means may it be good or something like that so still it is good okay the good is good the good is a really good translation boom have become boom have become 
so uh, boom have become you see have become so in if, if you remember in the past tense also we are using this word to make uh, make past tense so that's it so boom have become ch what ch they indicates future tense of the verb or it is like this indicates the future tense of the verb they as they i will uh, work i will study i will work so they means featured about it it is it, it is the in the case the future tense of the verb so in the case the future tense of the verb so you see after with this we use they and we put b this word became in future tense that's means lesson that's lesson the chim i go i am going a form of a form of the verb chun so chun to go so the chim chuyin actually chun right chuyin chun uh, if uh, we looked before we have looked before chun is our word and as you said as i said even i am always, always saying this if you are not sure simply search on here in, on on the wikipedia and chun for example when you have chun you say ch is for the for the manha which is present tense it is a long ch and for the mabori which is in the past tense is chu and it is the chum the chum i said that the ch is only for only for uh, present tense stem and the is the prefix that you put before this uh, stem when you want to make uh, a present tense and this um comes is comes accordingly i use i as the chim actually this means like at the chim when you say the chim simply say as the chim it doesn't it, it doesn't say go just just not go and that's it so chun is actually okay the chim and let's continue m we second personal uh, m m so it is we m m we it is second uh, group it, it, it is second groups it is like the second person uh, pronoun it is the second group one is the second m m me no it is the first group that's right as I said, like I want to write these groups again because those groups are really important. For example, I say as, de, el, m, hun, el. So when I am saying this, like this is I, you, she, he, it, m, we, hun, they, hun, you, el, they. So this is the first group and this generally became a subject in normal tenses without past tense. But in the past tense also, this one this is the object pronoun the second group becomes um becomes what becomes have we or we the second group becomes um the second group becomes uh, subject also m m m is like we and when you want to say the we me so this became me i was confused with this Hun, uh, they, hun, you, and hun, we, and one. So it's like this. So they say we, 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 so, oh yeah, <laughs> okay. I can feel like I'm saying we, oh, this is we, but in here it is in English, don't confuse this, it was M, which means we, we, this is we. Because this is in the English part, and this is we, so I just write the two group of them. Those groups are very important, and each time I just talk about them, I just wrote all of them. <laughs> I think it's very important. You have to know them. Are look, I said it's very important, and are simple enough. Just continue. Evar evening. Okay, in the evar, if you eat something, how do we say that? It is shiv. If you eat something, this is shiv. At this time, you eat shiv, which is dinner. As second uh, first pronoun, it is I, and it is I. It became like a song, uh, and as means I. I already mentioned in the private two two slides ago. Galak very many. Galak means very many a lot. Look, there are too many people. God, where are they walking? Galak uh, many. Okay, like what I said. I let me translate. Too many people. Galak, Galakas, 
too many people, too many person, too many people. Gala cast the mesh, the mesh. Too many people walks. There are too many pe people walk. We must be afraid. The V M Peterson. The V M M Peterson. Peterson. The V M Peterson. We 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 should afraid or we have to afraid. We should must afraid because too many people are working. The V M Peterson. The V should M Peterson. Tersin. Tersin. Then continue. Ha. Oh. Oh my God. Nalia. Oh my Nalia. Ha Nalia. Hi Naliam. Ha Nalia. Man. Nalia man. Ha Nalia man. So you can say that. Ha Nalia man. Oh my Nalia. So continue. J is from. You will never forget this. I am from. As J. As J. As J. As J. Amedeme. Amedeme. As J. Amedeme. As J. Amedeme. So you see. Okay. J. J. Two. Also. Look. Previous one. I said as J. Amedeme. As J. It means I too. Me too. As J. This is very important one. Could always use this. Always they have this. As J. Kif Oh, happy. Kif So this means Kif This is Kif Emoji. Kif khwash. Kif khwash. Kif 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 khwash. Okay. Kek. An address of form of the form for males. What? For for males. Kek. Oh, yeah. This is like, I okay. An address form for males. I don't know really why I just put this word one. But kek is kind of it doesn't kek kek also means this but also we use for for boy you know when you are so keka keka it means like boy or or like uh, something like boy okay something like boy keka but not you are not trying to get angry you, you are you are trying to be nice to him and you say keka keka is nice word keka for example even if you you are watching news uh, about Kurdistan that they say Kek Barzani so it because it is because they respect him Kek Barzani they, they always use this a lot if you can if, 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 if maybe you saw that even maybe you write like simply you write search like this on the Google you will find something but because of this word of course you will find him but only this one something will come surely something will come let's try I just wonder okay I am going to simply search this word on the on here so so you see kek masut but uh, it may amount to it's turkish yeah i think so yeah okay so it's the most the turks on turkish comes kek barzani kuder where kuder where kuder where 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 is it is here kuder here kuder kuder for example, let's say, where are you? Like, what you will say, where, 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 where are you? Where are you? Where are you? The Lukuderia. Why did I say just the Lukuderia? The Lukuderia, where are you? So this means same thing, the Lukuderia. Mamoste, teacher. I have Mamoste a lot. I, I am sure that you know. Merhaba is hello. Mehraba is also Slav, Slav, uh, I, I am sure because of I say, I say Merhaba there are many Kurds if they watch they will say no Merhaba is not Turkish Kurdish word it is come from Turkish come on boy Merhaba comes from Arabic let's search are you are you the, um, and the, the religion, the religion the, the, I'm saying religion Merhaba Merhaba origin ori, origin origin so origin is Arabic. So you see, this is written Arabja. By the way, I don't understand why this is Turkish. Is my browser Turkish? Ooh, strange. <laughs> okay. So you see, it's Arabic. So this is not this is not only Turkish. It's Arabic, and uh, you cannot force to that. Like Merhaba is like the word that comes from Arabic. So it's origin. It's originated to Arabic. So. Arabs are, Arabs are also the people in the Middle East for, for too long time. Arab, Persian, and Kurds are also 
too many years they are in the Middle East. That's why it's normal if their language is uh, affected. And let's go in, let's continue. Merhaba, salam, hello. Man, it means first prono first per person object pronoun. It's first man, first person object pronoun. Man khwast, I want. But in here, like man khwast, when I say I want, man khwast, it is in the past true, but man khwast. This became uh, this became the the subject and not the object true. Yes, it does because we all say it, we always say this. We always say this each time we see that we say we are saying this. I want, I want. All each time we say that there are two group groups in Kurdish language. This is object pronoun. Those are object pronoun, and the other group is like uh, as. Okay, I will write again as to um, hun no as to ev um, hun ev. So it is like this, and this is the first group. Generally, this is the this is called a subject a subject pronoun, and there are two groups always. Don't for never forget this. The other one is um, like this, and this is object pronoun actually. But in the past tense, the second group can be used as subject. We always say that na ne na no. So generally, we put na is alone is no, but ne na we generally put this in, in front of some words, and this became. Uh, this became negative. So generally, like this, we make now. For example, I say the khwazim, the 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 khwazim. I want. It means I want. I didn't put I, but be from here I can understand I want. Okay, let's divide this word. The is because of I am, I am saying this in present uh, perfect perfect tense. That's why. So khwazim, the khwaz. So. This is also um comes because of I use I and was was then. So let's be sure and let's go, go look here here. Let's look at here was was then was then was then. So was do you see was was? But I am I am making in the in the pre in the um, present tense. That's why I say was. So this is my stem. Now I have divided. Now I have separated everything. And what I do to make it uh, to make it negative, I simply I will put these accordingly the way you read to here. Nahwa. Then remove this. Nahwazim. I don't want. <laughs> How nice, right? That's good. Continue. Nav name. So this is name name. Okay. Ne. Not negotiation. Neg not negation. Not not true. The ne. So it also as is as as I said, like you can put ne na in front of the verb, but sometimes you simply put uh, in front of the uh, the the some some uh, word and it became like for example ne rasta is it means not true. So not true ne also became like that. What I think is, I think generally we only use ne when you want to put in front of this because I don't remember any word like na, na, ne raste, ne do, ne, ne raste, ne, ne khweshe, ne, khwesh, ne khweshe, ne. So you see, like generally we are putting ne, not something else. Na, now. So when the difference is like when the na is now, and from here to here you can understand uh, there is actually not too much differences between present tense and the and the past tense. I think really we in the for Kurdish language we don't have to say we have the present tense and and present tense and the present tense continues. Actually, we should say, <laughs> okay, I'm not professional of language, but. Because in the present tense, it, it is so much similar. It's nothing different, differs even. Anyway, Pashi, later on, Pashi, later on, Pashi, Pashi. For example, look at it, Pashve. Pash, Pashve. It means back and Peshve means front. I am even, even on my, even my own program teaches, teaches you a lot of things. Pashi, Pashi, later on, later on. Okay, Pashi. So per is also like galek, like galek, which is very many. 
push the after. I don't know when I search on Google this comes. It might be kind of weird movie. Push the after. Rojbash, good day. Good day, have a good day. It's kind of Rojbash, have a good day. Or good morning. Sachavan, you are welcome. That's it. Sachavan, 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 you are welcome. Chef, night. Okay, in the chef, if you eat something that is called what? That is called Shiv. And let's continue. Sebeh, Bayan, it's morning. Slav, greeting. Slav, 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 Geli, Havalan. Always I start, I say, Slav, Geli, 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 Havalan. Slav, Geli, Havalan. Always I start like this. Always I say, Slav, Geli, Havalan. Iro, am the Khwazan. Am the Khwazan. And I understand here you have a can. Iro, Iro, am the Khwazan. Hanek tishtan hani we bukun. I mean, hani We want to teach you something today. And let's continue. Te. So second person oblique pronoun. Tehwast. You want it. Tehwast. I think like oblique oblique pronouns. What is it? What is oblique pronouns? To be honest, I don't know. But it seems it is like the second group. And Tahwast, so second pronoun, see grammar one. So it says, see the grammar. Doesn't matter. Te, she coming. Um, te, te word is very important because in Kurdish, like, do you know passive, uh, passive, active voices? I have, I have, I have documents about this, but my document is not, um, so good. So I am trying to still develop it. I need to add, I need to add something, and need to do many things. But I want to make videos also about this. Te, we use te to make uh, the voice passive and the difference between passive and active. So passive and active. So the we want to we want to con we, when you want to convert the active voice to passive voice, how you do in 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 English. But in here we are doing like this. For example, I say pertuk pertuk te Juanden. When then, I think this is called uh, this is passive one, because it it, it is said which means uh, which means the book is the book is read is being read is being read so is being read so the book is being read so the, the, somebody reads the book and that that's how we do this. So that, as I said, my documents is not so much good still yet. Oh, still yet, everything is everything is not good. But uh, I am trying to make it good. After I made it perfect, I will just make it video. And second personal, so single pronoun, singular pronoun. Te to is you, simple enough. And khater khasten, khater khasten. I think the, I think we have to write this differently, not like this. Let's search. Khater khasten. Khater. Yeah, probably we, we need to write this differently. Khater is say, saying goodbye. Sometimes end of my video I say khater iwe. Khater khasten. Saying goodbye. To take fair, farewell. To say goodbye. Yeah. Khater khasten. Okay. I have a song actually. It is some... I, I will put in the description. Uh, what is it? I don't remember. The, I don't remember the song. But it is Dai es khater du khazim, something like this. Dai es khater du khazim. Okay, Juan Dekar, student. Juan Dekar, student. It's already Juan Dekar, student, you know it. Khwash, good, enjoyable. So do you see? Khwash, khair, those are good, enjoyable. And and here you are. Now you know what this means, khater. When I say it means see you. Khater khwazim. This is... I am saying see you, but this action is called khater khwasten. As khater jwad khwazim. It khater Okay. Let's end the video.